Stephen Nolan, Nutritics. So Nutritics is a food technology software that's designed to help food service businesses be safer, more sustainable and, and ultimately more profitable. We take complex supply chain information from food service. We support them in making their recipes and menus with the food data and then help them give that information to their customers in real time, be it on their website, be it on a food label. And it's ultimately to answer two questions. From a food service business side, what am I serving? And from a customer side, what am I eating? And our technology supports that. And we would support probably about 5 million food decisions every day. So customers who walk into a restaurant and decide, I don't want to have that sandwich because it contains this allergen, or I do want to have this particular choice for whatever reasons. At the moment, our main market is the UK. There's a huge opportunity in the UK. There's over a quarter of a million different eating locations, and it's right on our doorstep. And we're scaling quite rapidly in the UK, and the business will continue to expand towards the US. There's close to 1.8 million restaurants over there in various different guises. So between the UK and the US, we've got 2 million potential customers just sitting there and waiting for us, and we're only really scratching the surface of that. We've recently launched Foodprint, which is a software tool that will help food businesses understand, manage and report on the carbon impact that they have, both to their customers and to their investors and stakeholders. The research that we've done suggests that it will reduce the carbon emission of any particular recipe or sandwich by about 13% by having this information available and accessible. We estimate that next year it will take out about 27 million kilograms of CO2 from, from the environment, which is the equivalent to about 21,000 cars or, or 1.6 million trees. It's important to us that we have to leave this place in a better place than we found it. And we need to be doing what we can do internally as well within making the right choices around how we travel or how we source suppliers and so on, alongside supporting our customers to do that.